Hi everyone, Antoinette here from Ant's Place. Welcome to my channel. Uh, a couple of days ago on my channel, I posted a home tour, my first one on this channel. I had just taken down all the Valentine's decor and the house was cleaned and it was dusted and it was looking great. So I thought it was a perfect opportunity to put up a video. And it turns out that there's some sort of copyright uh, infringement or something like that because of the music I had used on that particular video and I think it was through a certain app that I used that I hadn't used for my prior videos. So I am going to repost my home tour and this time rather than hearing music you'll hear my voice over. So I'll go through the house and just sort of talk about I guess my furniture, sort of some of the pieces and the decor that I have around and things that are special to me and um, I will repost and hopefully you guys will like and subscribe that will be wonderful this is a new channel for me and I'm trying to get it up and running and going and I would just love if you guys uh, did that for me I hope that you enjoy the video um, coming after this video will be a taste of Mardi Gras I do a little bit of decorating for Mardi Gras I'll set the table and possibly even show you my pancake dinner. Um, after that, I'll have a little bit of some St. Patrick's Day decor. I do a bit for that and I'm kind of ramping it up a bit this year, doing more than usual because I have the channel now and I love St. Patrick's Day decorating. I think it's so much fun. I love the pop of green throughout the house. I love clovers. I love little leprechauns. I think they're all adorable. Um, so that will be coming. And then after that, I will start my my spring and Easter decorating and I'm going to be doing that in a series so I'll be going throughout the house and decorating little areas and then after that after those videos I'll do the spring and Easter home tour and after that um, we'll just take off we'll do a Mother's Day tea party and um, summer summer videos and and then before you know it it'll be Halloween I'll be doing Halloween Halloween is huge for me I love Halloween decorating I'm obsessed and then at the end of the year I'll be having my big Mackenzie Childs inspired Christmas and I hope you guys will join me for that because I'm so excited I'm getting ready for that already I've already been collecting some things and I think that's going to be a lot of fun so I hope you guys will join me um, and in order to see all those videos you'll have to subscribe so I hope you'll do that for me and I think it's going to be a lot of fun it's going to be a great ride and I hope you'll join me okay here's the home tour So we're starting this tour a little unconventionally rather than in the entrance we're starting at the back of the house which is the kitchen and the kitchen is used like in most homes um, it's used a lot and very loved and admittedly not always this tidy um, if you read that sign there about chocolate and balance if you know me you'll know why i have that in my kitchen And then we go to the kitchen table, which is from HomeSense here in Canada. We have some HomeSense. I don't know if that's in the States as well. And my little Ray Dunn collection. My sister bought me those pieces for Christmas. She has a huge Ray Dunn collection, so maybe I'll feature that one day. And then my clock, which my mom bought me. And then we go into my living room. So there's a little picture of my son and you will find that my son's pictures are all over. That little sparkly branch I won at a, a Christmas party one year and I find it blends in well with my decor so I tend to use it most of the year. And then my sectional with my white pillows and that picture, that painting on the wall there is from Bowering, which we no longer have here in Canada, which is so sad. It was my absolute favorite, favorite store. And then my little collectibles there, my gold cabinet from HomeSense. And that sort of old world print there. This corner here is pretty empty. I'm looking for the perfect corner shelving for that uh, area to do some more decorating. And that's the entrance there, as you see it from my living room. And that's the toilette, also known as the powder room. And 
And then if we look inside, I did the powder room in mostly black and gray. And these are all pieces that I've had really for quite some years. My black mirror. Me saying hello. Hello, everyone. And that black faucet, which we just got put in not too long ago. I love it. And then my rug from HomeSense. I shop at HomeSense a lot. <laughs> I love that look. And there's the entrance there. Now just to the right here, when you walk into my home actually, the dining room is on your left. And in this video it's on your right. It's a completely separate dining room, separate from sort of the living room. And I've had this furniture for as long as I've been married, so about 27 years. My tiered tray, which doesn't have anything on it right now, but I do like to decorate on it for the holidays. And I believe those candle holders are from Party Light. And all my little collectibles on my cabinet here, on my shelving. Um, some Mikasa dishes, some Royal Dalton some Royal Albert China there, some Royal Albert figurines. There's a picture of my husband and I back there. And then from the entrance, you go up a set of stairs. And just to the right of those stairs, when you go up, is our family room. And this is the family room. We spend a lot, a lot, a lot of time in this room. And on this little island here is just some pictures over the years. And like I said, my son is everywhere. And then this picture of my husband and I is from 1991. It was our first Valentine's together. And then our mantle, which this year my husband might possibly put in a deeper shelf there for me on the mantle so that I have more room to decorate. And then our 70 inch TV, which I never wanted. And I don't know why, because I absolutely love it now. We watch so many movies on that television and it's great. We have surround sound and it's wonderful. That little table there in the corner, my mom gave me. That's some leftover treats from Valentine's on our coffee table. And that painting there uh, is the oldest piece that my husband and I have. It's the very first piece we bought when we got married. And then that cabinet there with the three drawers, that's from Costco. And that painting you see there on the wall, that is a little Mackenzie Childs inspired. You can see the diamonds there on the left-hand side. And just a little taste of what's to come for Christmas. And all my little pieces there. Then my painting, that painting is also from Bowring. And this is a view of the upstairs from our family room. And this is a little cabinet that I bought from Bombay Company, which also closed here in Canada. It may have closed in the United States as well. So sad. That heart frame you might recognize if you saw my Valentine's tablescape this year. And that's the view of the family room from upstairs. And that is Bubbles. Bubbles is our other family member. And boy, is he sleepy here. And then if we go down the hallway, we have another table from Bombay, a rug from HomeSense. I love that rug. I have to admit, I really like it. 
That painting there to the left is also from Bombay many, many years ago. And I really used to love this look, this old world look. I still do, admittedly. And then the master bedroom. And so I like to have the master bedroom sort of calm and serene. So I don't overly decorate in the bedroom. I um, find it works better for me to fall asleep if I don't have too much distracting me in the bedroom. So, And I just like the look and the feel of a serene bedroom. And then this Bible here on the table, I um, got sick a couple of years ago, uh, quite sick. I'm still, I still have some of the effects of it, but um, a neighbor of mine had found out at Christmas time that I was sick. And the next day she um, dropped off this book for me at my front door. She was so sweet. And I have used that book ever since. And this is my collection here. I didn't know where else to put this collection, so I have it in my bedroom. And it's a collection of small pitchers and bowls. So not the larger kind that they would have used back in, oh, I don't know, Victorian time maybe, um, to wash their face and whatnot. But these are just smaller versions of those. And I love these. And so I don't even know if I can collect anymore because I, I don't have room in that cabinet. And then our dresser with a few little pieces and figurines that mean a lot to me. These are all special pieces to me. And that's me, hello. And then our chest of drawers here has our wedding picture above. That used to be in a picture frame. I didn't like the frame anymore, so I took it out and I just left it out plain. That painting is one that my son did and uh, just some other pieces that I've collected. That door on the right there is our ensuite bath and then our closet on the left. And then this is the hallway as you would see it coming out of the master bedroom. And then our main bathroom to the left there, which is in the middle of getting redecorated and renovated. And just a little piece there. And that's it. I hope you enjoy it.